I took on golf several years ago when I was starting a business of my own and I thought it would be perfect for um, networking and professional relationship building. And then my husband and I uh, decided to get a dog and we were toying around with the idea of getting a big breed. And here we were picking up a tiny little guy, a Weimar Reiner. He could care less for tennis balls, but he loves golf balls. I was outside one summer day. I took my pitching wedge and a few practicing golf balls and you know, I was just swinging. Mr. Victor obsessed with golf balls. Then maybe a year old or so, he was outside with me and got super excited about this round of object that was being hit and then he somehow got really excited about chasing it and catching it. And then on top of that, collecting them all into one spot, which was perfect. Isn't that exactly what you want? Victor, get it, take it, take it. I spent a lot more time practicing golf and practicing my short game because the dog enjoys it so much. I think it's mutually beneficial. I put in the time to practice the sport that I enjoy playing and then he gets a good run out of it and then we both enjoy each other's time. It's interesting, but I think having the dog that loves chasing golf balls, as crazy as it sounds, is making me a better golfer. It's the amount of time that I put in, the extra time that I put in to practice, and then just the energy and the passion that he shares, sort of, it rubs off on me. It's, it's a very indirect way of sharing passion. Victor never stops. Oh! <laughs>